Hello everybody, this is Dragoon 1140 here, bringing you the next For the Noobs Elements, the game video. Last time we discussed light and its blessed pegasi, as somebody has corrected my grammar. This time we're going to talk about another fun element that offers lots of control and is pretty semi-popular, gravity. This time we're going to be discussing how funny it is, how quickly it is that you can do this. Okay, first thing, as always, remove all the other cards from the deck, so all Quantum Pillars and the Dagger. This time we're going to be selling all the Earth cards. Make sure your card limit is 30, otherwise you cannot go to the Bazaar. Sell everything at once. Go to your Gravity tab over here, and you buy one Momentum, one Gravity Shield. And preferably... Uh, let's just stick that to now and see where we do. Take up two Stone Pillars, add those. And what you're going to do now is add another Sapphire Charger. Sapphire Chargers are definitely one of the best gravity cards they have to offer. Even though it's, uh, even though its attack is weak when it's unupgraded, that momentum will save you so many times. And right off the bat, before we even do any quests or accept any rewards or even battle an AI, you have a competent gravity deck. I mean, from this point on, it can be customized any way you want. I mean, gravity pulls, um, it's where your creatures can attack another creature, and it's the only case possible. Anyway, it's great cre creature control, so you can add more of those. You can add more OTUGs, OTUGs, I'm pretty sure that's how that's pronounced. Uh, more momentums, and more gravity shields. And now I'm going to test the level 1 AI, just so you guys can get the taste of what's going on. We roll second, of course. Okay, looks like we have a decent starting hand. Play all your gravity pillars. With your gravity pillars plus your mark, you shouldn't have any trouble playing cards. Perfect. I'm playing a card called the Odiug. And what the Odiug is, it devours creatures that has less hit points than it is. It's arguably the best creature control in the game if your opponent doesn't have any creature control. Ironic, eh? So what you do is you use one gravity quantum to eat a creature of lesser hit points. And you gain attack plus one hit points, so you get stronger and stronger. Now, now we're playing a card called Gravity Shield. And what Gravity Shield is, is it blocks any creature that has more than five hit points. That may not seem like a big deal, but once your Odia hits that magic six hit point marker, almost nothing can stop you unless they have creature control. Now, obviously, give or take, I mean, they could have creature control itself, they could have freeze, they could have delay, which is rather annoying, or procrastination, which has the skill delay. And you guys can realize now what Momentum does. Sapphire Charger comes into the game with Momentum, and what Momentum is, is it can ignore all shields, no exceptions. This includes Dimensional Shield, which it didn't use to a while ago. Now, every other creature that's in play right now, including the Odiug and the Armagio I just played, they'll get blocked for one turn according to the skill that Procrastination has. Sapphire Charger won't. So as you can see, these two creatures are blocked for one turn and I cannot use their skills, while Sapphire Charger, I can still use them all I want. Gravi Graviton Mercenary is just another creature, just basic vanilla, awesome. More, We need more creatures like that, by the way. And Armagio, which has the seal Gravity Pull, which, if you haven't noticed already, we have that spell on our deck. And what that means is that since it has a massive 25 hit points, it can take 25 hit points worth of hits and that saves you and in essence adds more to your health. Now we have the spell momentum which adds 1-1 one, one to our creature and it ignores shields. So we're going to add that to our Odiug and he becomes a 2-5 creature that can ignore procrastination so right now we are basically invincible. Play more creatures and you should eventually win. I'm surprised this opponent doesn't play more creatures. I mean, I understand it's level 1 AI, which means that almost all of their creatures are random, but instead they have annoying spells. The spell he just cast on me was called Aflatoxin, and what Aflatoxin does, it adds two poison counters to your whatever creature it infects, and by the time it dies, I'll show you what happens once it dies. I would recommend you only stick to two gravity shields right now. In a 30 card deck, two shields is more than enough to fuel you. Now, once the creature dies from aflatoxin, it turns into a malignant cell. 
What a malignant cell does is something you do not want on your side of the field. It's a 1-1 one, one creature that generates itself every turn. So, as you can see, I only have one right now, but we have two. Now, normally, this is possibly the worst shield to protect against this if you use aflatoxin. Normally, you want something that blocks one um, damage. So, instead, we have creatures being uh, built every turn. Now, normally this might seem like a good thing, but after a while you realize, I have no creature slots to play. So that is definitely not good. The weapon the level 1 AI just played was is a rare weapon called Arsenic. There are 12, yes, 12 rare weapons in the game right now, one for each element. This is called Arsenic, and what it does is deal 1 poison damage at the end of every turn with an additional 2. So, as you can see, I'm poisoned for one, which is unavoidable. I'm pointing at the screen, which I don't know why. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, it's unavoidable, and it's just, eh. It's a rare weapon, though, so if you happen to win it in the slots, very lucky. That is Gravity's deck for today. Um, it can be customized any way you want. I mean, you could add six Sapphire Chargers and um, just six Graviton Mercenaries and six Momentums, and that alone will make a great deck. Anyway, gravity, fun element, not my favorite, but offers awesome creature control. See you all next time.